So for me, love is not one dimension. Like, there's a lot of layers to when you love somebody in different categories that you put love and people into. I think some things are interchangeable, some things you can accept for other people and you can't for other people. I think love is just one of those things that is, at the end of the day, an energy and a feeling. Um, for me personally, I even feel like I've learned to just understand people and let love be, um, and really love people for who they are and not trying to change them, not trying to... And I, I think that also comes with the self-love, of course, like understanding and loving yourself to the fullest capacity allows you to let other people be who they want to be and who they are at their full capacity. And you don't feel any type of way behind it or anything like that. Um, so I always take everything that every, anyone even does with a grain of salt, even if it comes in the form of hatred. I always say hatred is just love in disguise in a different way. So along with envy, literally, oh. Drake literally said it best, or, and jealousy. Jealousy is just love and hate at the same time. He said it best with that. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, like, it really is. Like, and you have to understand, like, we live in a world where so many people can't already process so many emotions that they have. Like, we have to be... We have to be nurturing. Like, I don't think we take time to really be nurturing to other people who even would wrong us. And for me, I'm always trying to do that and live better and better the next day. So I think that's all encompassing love because that's also falls in line with the all and who we are. Like, everything is connected. So the more kindness that you pass around, the more that not only it comes back to you, even though that shouldn't be your 100% reason in doing it, you should just do it. But, you know, it, it, it does come back and it comes back in tenfold a lot of times so you know I just that's love to me like it's of course there are the, the examples of relationships and everything like that but I, at the end of the day I do find that we don't own anybody like we literally come into this world alone we leave alone but at the same time we experience people in certain time frames for that duration for a reason and then we move on or if there are people who need to stay in our life they stay so i think what also comes with honor is letting people go in that if they need to go and like she said it's a whole spiel on love i literally could go on and on about that because it's it's really deep and it ties in with a lot of different factors like pain and anguish hurt sadness all those types of things are all encompassing of love but like i said that's a whole other situation <laughs> <laughs>